Have you lost all faith in content creation and creators in general? Well, I almost did too, until the Avengers were formed. An elite group of content creators working overtime to bring back that spark in content creation we haven't seen in years. But first, we must analyze this issue. It's no secret that content creation has been on a downward spiral recently, with most creators nowadays producing the most clout farm, lackluster bullshit, and gaining major success from a young, impressionable audience. I think we're all tired of seeing the OnlyFan girls, the fake pranks, and the drama being our only resource in today's content. It's like these new creators have nothing but dust and shit in their brains, and if they don't use one of those three things as content, they're just doomed. Which is a major downgrade compared to back in my day, when being a content creator was mainly just based on your personality and how well you can connect with your audience. Most of the creators back then simply just built an empire off recording themselves doing things that they enjoy, whether it be storytelling, being super good at video games, or just making skits that show off who they are. There's really no cheat code to success during this time period. You either had it or you didn't, and not to mention attention spans weren't completely fried during this time. So creators could actually drop 30 minute plus long videos and build that dedicated hardcore audience that would literally watch you take a shit just because they were so loyal. I would generally refer to this time as a golden age of content creation, just off the personalities being so strong and the community being so supportive to the creator compared to nowadays which is basically just supporting a creator because you like whatever low effort bullshit they're throwing at you which basically sums up most content now it's just cheap views the focus from using your personality in order to generate traffic has turned into using external things in order to get these views which most of those external things being negative brain rot to say the very least and we entered the dark ages during this time period every trick in the book was being used to funnel in views grandma died you better put that shit on youtube bro you need the views you got a new girlfriend you better get her ass on stream and milk those views baby you see a random person walking in public harass them you need the views when in doubt in our darkest times there was a few glimmers of hope heroes if you will with the purpose of bringing back these core principles we have been lacking and missing for so long the new age of content creation dad i just hit one million this is a po this is possible now i just want to do that I made it a goal of mine my whole teenage years, you know, tried to upload videos, didn't work out. The amount of motherfuckers that never believed in me, bro. <laughs> but God did. <laughs> Welcome to the present day enlightenment. All right, I'm done using all these weird fucking terms. Let's just talk about these new creators that I feel like have been going crazy recently, and they're also bringing back those old core memories. But Jinxie, this guy literally blew up off playing his favorite game and being fucking hilarious at it. He took his time and it fucking worked out for him. He wasn't doing whatever it took to get cheap views like I was talking about. He wasn't disregarding all morals. He actually kept a good moral standing. And look, it fucking paid off. And that's really respectable, especially nowadays. And it's really showing like a new leaf. It's going back to those old hardcore values. Another creator I would like to give their flowers to in recognition is queso i'm sure you guys have heard of this guy but if you haven't then please go check him out much like jinxie queso used his personality and built a fucking empire on it using both his shortcomings and advantages to take him to the moon literally that's it there was no external resources he didn't sign no fucking deal didn't do nothing crazy this is like a dude you'll see at fucking walmart or AutoZone. just an average down-to-earth guy quite literally the definition of what it means to be a content creator just being yourself and reflecting that onto your audience if you're interested in content creation, then go for it, bro. You could be who you are and do what you want to do and still make it somewhere. Look at these guys I just showed you. You could be the next one.